Okay, guys, how we doing? All right, so uh, what's going on? Welcome in here to Kurt Magoosh Slaughterhouse Sports. Today we got Kenny Johnson. You know, he's listed some places 6'1", some places 6'2". You know, Pittsburgh, again, they've been in the news because they lost Jordan Addison uh, to USC. But this kid's out of Dallastown, Pennsylvania, all right? Going to tell my buddy near, near Lancaster uh, to go out and watch this kid, uh, my friends in Lancaster, uh, because he's right in Dallastown, and it's Kenny Johnson, all right? And Kenny Johnson at 6'1", this kid are at 6'2". He has great size, so he's great height. And every route, he's he shows full-on effort running out every single route. He's very twitchy. Um, he has great acceleration. And I think that the upside for Kenny Johnson, um, I think that, that, he, that he has an upside that um, – it could land him possibly in the NFL. He has NFL upside. He has great length as he reaches to catch the football. All right, so this kid is an explosive football player. All right, look at the confidence there. Like, watch. Like, I got this guy, okay? Throw the ball up. I'm going to make you right, okay? And he does in between three defenders. He really is elite when it comes down to catching the football in traffic, okay? He has he has very, very good speed, okay? This kid can fly. This kid is fast, all right? I don't care what he runs his 40 time in, his play speed, there's a great urgency to the way that he plays football. And, you know, listen, Penn State, I think, is after this kid. Watch this. This is a very talented catch, okay? Low hands kind of a grab, okay? basket catch he can do so many things like if you throw him a back shoulder he he you know he can easily catch a back shoulder late watch how he flies across the field here he plays on punt returns as well um I don't know if there was a penalty on that play that prevented a touchdown but this is a very explosive football player a long strider a guy that's going to be really tough to cover he's going to be a matchup nightmare in the ACC this kid is more like a high four-star to me than he is a mid-tier three-star, which is what he is on a lot of recruiting sites. So I believe that this kid is going to really rise his, raise his stock and, and the ability that he has to separate there. Watch that route. I love that. Burns the guy, all right? Absolutely sticks the guy and then goes to the fade route and goes up and really catches the ball aggressively. All right, so this guy's a good route runner, really good route runner, very explosive football player, and can really make contested catches, which is really what I appreciate. So this is actually one of the really good players that I've seen in this class. This guy can make really difficult catches, and this could be maybe one of the top 15 receivers in this class. All right, I know he's listed towards 100, but I think that he could, you know, when this is all said and done, I'm curious to continue to watch some of these other players. But this kid is already, you know, I haven't covered every kid in this class, but he's he, he's hovering around the top 15 just because you can throw the ball up to him. He's a big target. You know, he really finishes plays. He makes explosive catches. All right. And Pittsburgh needs some juice. They need to continue the momentum that was stemmed from winning the ACC championship with Kenny Pickett. Mark Whipple ends up leaving. They lose Jordan Addison. I don't know who the quarterback is going to be next year. Okay. But wow. I mean, you get a great recruit right in your backyard, right from the Lancaster area. You're going to beat out Penn State for a big-time wide receiver. And that is exactly what Kenny Johnson is. I think he could be a real terrific football player. He's a guy that can go up and high point the ball. He can separate for sure. And he's a guy that runs every route at the same speed. Um, and, and he could play special teams and show signs of misdirection. So he really has a lot of traits that you look for in an elite wide receiver. And I believe that this kid has great potential going to Pittsburgh. I'm talking all conference type of ability. It's Kenny Johnson, a recent new commit to the Pittsburgh Panthers.